What's up, everybody out there in the Frontline Universe? I'm Chris, and welcome back to another Dark Avenger haul. Look at the pile of books. Freaking awesome. But anyway, this video is a couple of days late, but by the time you're watching this, 2 to 1, it's going to be Happy Halloween. So, Happy Halloween, everybody. I hope you guys get all the candy you guys um, have been waiting for all year long. If you're an adult, hopefully you're enjoying a nice Halloween party. If you're an adult still getting candy, I won't judge you. On camera, at least. Uh, but good for you good for you and I decided to put together a makeshift costume this this mask is not part of the haul this mask was part of one of the first five hauls that I did here on comic frontline if you want to know who got this for me where I got it what this mask is you can go check it out I just added the hat to put a little dash of interesting to my costume that isn't really a costume it's just a mask and a hat so it's Indiana Jones meets Slipknot it's indie slip or slip indie whatever anyway we got a nice amount of books this week we got a nice amount of extras and i found something in the store which was really cool i actually got two of them one is on my window and one is here kind of spoiled that sorry uh but anyway um i waited an extra day to see if we would get our midtown box with one of the books that is not in this week's haul video that you will see on the dark avenger comic book review episode which is action man's revolutions one shot I thought that if I waited the extra day, it would come in the mail. It didn't. I apologize. Uh, but it's a Halloween haul video, even though I'm recording it before Halloween. By the time most of you watch it, because it's getting late tonight, uh, it will be Halloween. Or it's at least Hallow's Eve. So either way, we're in the Halloween festive spirit. So let's get through these books. Let's get through some extras, and let's have a good time, shall we? In Midtown... I don't know what to say to you guys. You guys need to fix your shipping. Ever since this time last year... Michael and I decided to switch to DCBS, and we are so, so happy we did. If you are going to buy comics this much a week, and you want something where you could just literally put down the money for everything in a single month, I would highly recommend going to DCBS. I was very skeptical at first. I'm so glad we decided to um, give it a shot, because man, I gotta tell you guys, DCBS has nothing, been nothing but a pleasure since we started with them, I've really, really enjoyed all the stuff that uh, DCBS, the way they ship their stuff, the time that the stuff gets here. It's literally, it gets here in no less than about two days. And I just, I just really enjoy DCBS. And this mask really, ugh. So anyway, let's get through this because this mask is killing me. We've got you, issue number 59. One more issue to go before the grand finale of Chu. Titans issue number four, continuing Wally West story with uh, the Titans. Oy. The Flash, I love this cover. This cover is really cool. The Flash issue number nine, Wally from both worlds. Okay, sorry guys, I can't do it. I can't. I thought I could do this whole video with the mask on. I just, I cannot. Give me a second as I'm systematically trying to slide the mask down. Ah. Oy. That was killing my eyes. Ah, it's even scarier. No, I'm just kidding. So, oy. you can sweat in those things when you're in a hot room. Got Future Quest issue number six. And you can hear me better now, too. So, Future Quest issue six. Got Hal Jordan and the Green Lantern Corps issue number seven. Oi, God. I said oi uh, a nice amount of times in this video. The Hellblazer, issue number three. Saga, issue 39. Suicide Squad, issue number five, going into the next story arc. Teen Titans, issue number one. I don't know why I put that in the middle, but Teen Titans, issue number one. Probably Mike went to read his book and threw it back into the middle of the pile instead of to the top. Uh, Street Fighter Unlimited, issue 11. As well as Street Fighter... Here, let's pull this out now. Street Fighter Legends Kami, issue number four of, I think, five. I think there's one more issue after this, if I'm not mistaken, because I don't think it came out in December. Got Sonic Universe, this is issue 91. This is a variant cover. Batgirl, issue number four. Blue Beetle, issue number two. Deathstroke, issue number five. Punisher's Halloween Annual. 
It says annual number one, but I'm going to call it a Halloween annual because that's what it looks like. Wonder Woman issue nine. I'm really, I'm really excited to read this book. I did skim it a little bit. We obviously got our books two days ago, so I started reading. And man, I'm really excited to review Wonder Woman. Got Birthright issue number twenty. Civil War two issue number six, which should have been over already, but instead they extended in another book. TMNT Universe issue number three. I believe this is the end of the first story arc. I believe. I could be wrong. Batman Detective Comics, 943. Action Comics, 966. Really cool cover there. Vigilante, issue one of three. I don't know if Michael or myself will read it, but we're going to give it a shot and see if we want to continue it after this. And Batman Beyond, issue number one. The last time it was a one-shot. It was the one shot, the rebirth one shot that came out last time. So a nice amount of reading this week, a lot of reading this week, and we got started late because of the obvious, you know, we were late last week, so we're going to try our best to catch up. So really quick, also out this week, let's throw these out there right now, we've got previews, 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 we've got Preview Magazine, this is issue number 338. I don't know why they number these, but anyway, this is for books coming out the first month of 2017. We will be doing a preview uh, review, uh, video, I want to say sometime next week. Also with it, we got previews for Marvel. There is our Marvel book. They'll go together. This will not be part of the previews video, but we did also get Image Plus. To continue Negan's story. I love the poster that's in this week's um, book. It is Dustin Weaver's. Uh, there. Really cool stuff. So there you go. That's the preview stuff. Look forward to a previews video. Like I said, Michael and I should be shooting it sometime next week. Also out this week. We got Taboo Tattoo Volume 4. And ReZero Volume 2. Love ReZero. ReZero was a great series. And Taboo Tattoo was another really fun read. Uh, I enjoyed wa an another enjoyable story in general. So really happy to have both of these. As you guys know, I'm only getting a certain amount of manga series um, from now on. Also, I will before I share those, I found this in the store. And I thought it was really cool. They started putting out Christmas stuff. But apparently, Superman from the Justice League, it is a window cling. Apparently... Uh, the Justice League is now part of the Christmas window cling whole thing. So I got two because it was two for, I think, four dollars, two for four or whatever. So this one I'm leaving in package and one is on the window over there. So whenever we record on Comic Book Corner and we can show the window, you'll see the other Superman. It's already clinging to that window. I, I just thought it was hilarious that they had it. Classic Superman. Really cool. I had to grab it. So I did. It was super cheap. And then out this week as far as games go... Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 was the first game that came out. This is all Michael. I'm not really into the fighting games, but Michael is. So he got himself Xenoverse 2. That's what the disc looks like. So he'll be playing this over on Frontline Gaming Zone, hopefully soon. I want to say soon before I said zone. Uh, so hopefully he'll get to that as soon as possible. And for me, Titanfall 2 came out this week. This I am really going to be delving into as soon as possible as well uh as you guys know frontline gaming zone we started streaming on there already uh right now i did i did one stream for the for destiny i did one stream last night for the division tonight we're going to be very busy doing halloween havoc stuff tomorrow if you're watching this on monday for halloween michael and i both will be doing two separate streams michael will be doing one with the playstation vr with russia blood and i'll be doing one of a regular horror game or not horror but more of a scary game or a jump scare game whatever you want to call it uh later on in the day so stay tuned and then after that we've got titanfall 2 we've got dragon ball xenoverse we've got we finished destiny for now we've got the divisions dlc um, and we've got Battlefield 1, some multiplayer there in the story, which the campaign is notoriously, notoriously short. I think I'll finish it in like two days, so we're going to see what we're going to do with that. But we got a lot of really great games, and next week we got another game coming out. It's going to be a really fun time for Frontline Gaming Zone. For those of you that like gaming and haven't already done it, please go over to Frontline Gaming Zone. Give that channel a sub if you want to see some really awesome walkthroughs. we got a lot of things we're planning for that channel. Finally getting the channel off the ground and moving forward, which I'm really happy about. 
So with that, that's it for this haul, guys. I'm sorry I couldn't stay in the mask too long, but man, it gets hot in this room. It might be because the the heat and the. Anyway, thank you guys so much for being here. If you like to comment below any of your thoughts on the books here, what we got thoughts on anything I have here, recommendations for books or recommendations for anything in general, let me know. As always, we are Comic Frontline, your number one source for comic-related news, reviews, and a whole bunch more. Never gets old saying that, and it never gets old asking you guys if you're new and this is your first video on Frontline. If you enjoyed it, hopefully you'll click the sub button right underneath this video, and you will be part of the Frontline subscriber universe, and we will have all of our videos in your sub box. We have a video a day at least, and you won't miss out on a single one of those videos. And if you want even more Comic Frontline goodness that's not on YouTube, Go swing over to ComicFrontline.com and check out some really cool stuff over on Frontline.com. Till next time, everybody. Take care. Keep reading. Keep collecting. I'm reaching over here for no reason whatsoever. And I'll see you guys really soon in the next video.